Now to the primary election results this morning. An underdog snatched the Republican nomination for U.S. Senate. Take a look at the results. Leora Levy is set to square off now with Senator Richard Blumenthal in November. Channel 3 Ibanez News reporter Roger Susanna now joins us live at the state capitol. And Roger, this result came as a huge surprise to many people. Yeah, good morning. And it really did. The one person, though, who apparently was not surprised was Leora Levy. From the very beginning, she expressed confidence that she was going to defeat the perceived frontrunner, Themis Claritus. And last night, she essentially backed up her words with a relatively resounding victory. And in some ways, you could argue Levy's win is also a triumph for Donald Trump. Levy's campaign received a big boost when the former president formally endorsed the Greenwich businesswoman last week. Levy has never been elected to any office, but she's no political outsider. Levy is a member of the Republican National Committee. Last night, she pulled off an upset by defeating the state party's endorsed candidate, former Connecticut House Minority Leader Themis Claritus, who is more moderate on social issues, and conservative immigration leader Peter Lumage. Last night at her victory celebration in Greenwich, Levy told her supporters that this is just the beginning. We found hope here in America. And... So, my American dream is, here I am as a candidate for the U.S. Senate. So there's no denying, obviously, that last night was a huge night for Leora Levy. But now, an even bigger challenge is on the horizon. She's trying to become, or will try to become in November, the first Republican to win a U.S. Senate seat here in Connecticut in more than three decades. But, you know.